can I help you? Uh, yes. Is is this the Melville Planetarium? You have the money? Oh, oh, the fifty dollar entrance fee. Yeah, of course. Excuse me. What are you looking at? Oh, oh, nothing. Do you have change for 60? That's fine. Okay. Um, <laughs> Please, come on. Thank you. Strange place for a planetarium. It's very rustic. Mm. Uh, Entrance fee? Bucolic. Thank you. <laughs> um. Right this way. Huh? And this is where the magic happens. We have our uh, observatory right here, state-of-the-art, government grant and all that. Uh, this is where I chart out the different stars of the true galaxies. I observe them from afar. And then, for you, we have something special. Oh, how nice. Since you are a tourist, we're going to show you the projection of the entire observable universe. So this is the universe. The stars are as far as you can see. Right here is the entrance to the Andromeda Galaxy, the closest to ourselves, the Milky Way. Uh, very popularly known at this point among sci-fi viewers. Uh, over here a few of the stars, NZ, Sub, sub Enta, NTW, Tom, LZ, and the Quasar over there. Um, this is a nice little spiral super, supernova that will one day turn into a black hole and kill us all. And a nice find that I'm very proud of is over here. Two comets that will hit each other approximately 2.3 light years. They'll do no damage to anything besides themselves, so the science community doesn't consider them a real discovery, but it's big. A funny thing that a lot of people don't know is that all the way over there in the corner of the galaxy is our little blue planet called Earth. We don't have one sun, we have four of them. Otherwise, how could so many places get sunlight at the same time? It can only be explained by that many stars. And planets such as Mars or Venus being so close that's the only explanation as to why we can actually see them without super-powered, magnificent computers like mine. Therefore, I have figured out that Venus is actually only approximately 400,000 miles away from Earth. And, again, is surrounded by more stars than we had ever thought imaginable. Quite thrilling, if I do say so myself. Are you sure that that's true? It could really be that close? I mean, it looks so far away when you, when you see it in the night sky. No, it, uh, I, I've proven it. Well, what, where's your work? Can I see? That's confidential. Oh, okay, of course. How about those two pl the, the comets that you talked about? Are you sure that they won't cause any harm? I believe that there might be a sense of danger, but again, the government does not believe me. Mm. Interesting. Do you think that's that's really... Uh... You lied. What? You were followed here. What, 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 are you, what are you talking about? The FBI, they're here, aren't they? They're with... <laughs> You can't know about my work. It's confidential. Only I can know! <laughs>